This is Twit. To Salt Lake City we go Dave, Leo Laporte, the tech guy. Hi, Dave. Hey, Leo. How are you today? I'm good. You got one of those Amazon shows. Aren't they cool? They are great. I actually, before I get in trouble with the men's club here, I got it for my mother-in-law because I could get the two-for-one deal. You know, when Yeah, like I did that 300. for my mom. I did the same thing. You got two-for-one. You got it yeah. like 100 bucks off. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So that's why I got it. There's but, never yeah. anything wrong with getting along with your mother-in-law. No, I guess good, not. It's a good thing. Not always easy, yeah. but it's a good thing. Yeah, so I can, like, use my phone because I've got the gadget on my phone and call home. And and do you know, call my show? Right. But we can't figure out how to call from my show to my mother in law's show. Right. And you can do it. You can actually do the drop in too. But she has to allow it. So the first thing uh, you have to do is make sure that she's in your contact list and you're in her contact list in on the on the on the show, so that it knows okay. she has a show. And then you need to know the name of her show. So okay. when you, I'm sorry, go back. Oh. In the contact list as a phone number? Or yeah. I, I, yeah, okay. so she's identified by her phone number uniquely. Obviously, it doesn't use that phone number. Okay. Uh, but that's how she's identified. Amazon has a pretty good setup on uh, the Amazon site How to about drop-in, how to use drop-in. Um, okay. And so, and it is a little it's a little tricky. I use it with my mom, and it's really f fantastic. She, of course, has to give permission. She can say, mm -hmm. and there's several different levels. She probably should say, only people I, I know can drop in on me. Um, it, it is, uh, you can also do the call thing. But go into the, uh, uh, schedule. I shouldn't say that word out loud. You know what I'm talking about, though. The Echo <laughs> yeah. app on your, on your phone. And uh, there's a conversation icon. And if you tap get started, you, oh, now. <laughs> mine, mine woke up. Mine woke up. <laughs> Shut up! Oh, she's gonna talk for a while now. No, go away. Oh, please stop! Oh my God, I can't believe she's gonna talk to me now. Except, oh good, she stopped. <laughs> Ask her to tell you a Star Wars. No. <laughs> Wait a minute. I have to turn on my, my turn off my microphone for just a second so I could say the A word. Okay, I think I've, I've, I think I've stopped her. I have too many uh, echoes in my. Uh... It's great to meet you, Alexa. Right. Let's get to know one another. Oh. So are you Excuse me, I have to unplug something. I'm just gonna go over here and I'm gonna unplug this it's tool of the devil. All right. You won't be hearing her from her again. <laughs> I'm surprised she doesn't sing Daisy Jersey. <laughs> So you do do it by phone number. So you have to verify your phone number. And that's how, even though you're not really making a phone call, that's I think that's often the disconnect on that, is that you're, you, okay. she has to be in your contact list by phone number and you have to be in hers. Because that's a unique way to identify somebody, better than mom or mother-in-law or something like that. Okay. And uh, But there's a, there if you, on the Amazon site, I would suggest, I did it, you walk through the, how to how to uh, enable drop in and there's so there's two different things there's drop in and then there's the call feature she may prefer call she may not want you dropping in on her although with close family i think it's really cool i, I let my mom drop in and we have because we mm -hmm. have our show in the kitchen we don't have it in the bedroom obviously but in the kitchen uh, when we're cooking and she'll drop in and and it's cool because i'll be making you know mom's spaghetti sauce I say, mom i'm making your sauce and and we'll talk while i'm doing it. and it's really kind of a neat thing it has a camera she can see me i can see her we have a screen on both i think you're going to really like it yeah. uh, if, if well, that's now, are you are is she on your account or does she have her own separate account you know what i don't even think she has an account and that well, might be part of the problem too. so when you get somebody in echo uh mm -hmm. it associates it with an account and if you buy it it probably associated it with your account so okay. it, that may mean that she, and my mom ended up doing this because she said, I'm tired of seeing your calendar alerts <laughs> and all the stuff for you. So I, I helped her and you can do this. Uh, in, she'll need to put the Echo app on her phone. And it has to be on the same network as her Echo. And then you can walk her through deregistering and re-registering the Echo to her Amazon account. If she doesn't have an Amazon account, if it, then you can use yours, but then it doesn't do it by phone. Then it's a little bit easier. It just does it by name because it thinks it's on your 
For instance, right. mine here is associated with my account and the same account at home. So I can say to uh, my Echo, I say, Echo, drop in on Kitchen Show, and it will just turn on the Kitchen Show, and I can see who's there. So that doesn't need a phone number. But that has to be the same Wi-Fi network, right? It does. Uh, no, I'm here at work oh. on a different Wi-Fi network. But oh, okay. it has to be the same Echo account. You can okay. you can also, uh, Dr. Mom's reminding me, deregister her on your account. You can just go in there and say, that that's not my Echo. <laughs> that's not my Echo. <laughs> she should get an Echo account, I mean, Amazon account probably, so that way she has her own thing. And then it's by phone number. Does that? Did okay, I just confuse perfect. everything? Look at look at the manual. <laughs> Leo no, Laporte, the, the tech guy. Echo, shut up! 